I love restaurants like this, just jammed into a random place. Like this Chinese restaurant that's shoved under an internet cafe. Or is the cafe on top of the Chinese restaurant? We'll never know. I love Chinese food in Japan. It reminds me of Chinese food in America. That sort of strange version of what at some point may have been a culturally important traditional Chinese dish, but it's now just sitting under a heat lamp crying. This is that, but minus the heat lamp and about 75,000 times better. I got this subuta set. Subuta literally means vinegar pork, but it's more like sweet and sour pork that we have in the States. The pork is crispy and the onions are piled a mile high. It features a sweet and sour sticky sauce that has just a little bit of heat thanks to some dried chilies. Overall, it was well balanced and the portion size was perfect, which is quite the shock when I'm used to slithering out of Chinese buffets in America like a slug. Make no mistake, I need to be clear, I'm not hating on American Chinese food. I love it, and if there was one thing I could have someone send me, it would be a big old takeout box of lo mein and some general tzos, and crab rangoons. I would do absolutely terrible, awful things for some crab rangoons right now. As I was eating my fried rice, I had a crazy thought come over me, and instead of fighting it, I just let it happen. I had a bunch of onions left over, so I put it in my fried rice. This is art. We had to improvise.